Hi, this is Di's Bass Play Mom, and this video is for the Real Beal fam. Yes, if you are part of the family of people who leave me awesome comments down below or watch every video, this video is for you. I need to tell you what's going on. One, I went to the eye doctor today and my eyes are dilated. I have a slight headache, so I'm gonna make this quick. I want to tell you some exciting news. I don't even know how to explain how I feel about it. I'm playing this weekend. Ladies and gentlemen, I have a gig. My church is gonna reconvene. We are making this video. I'm making it on August 31st, the last day of August 2020. And we are still in phase two in Washington State. I live near Seattle of our COVID-19 quarantine and my church is getting back together. Now, I expect a much smaller group. We're doing one service instead of the three services we would usually do. It's all gonna be weird. I'm gonna mask up, but of course, I'm the bass player. I'm next to the drummer. He is behind a plastic shield, the safest guy from any known viruses. Yeah, it's coming. I have a set list. Oh my gosh, I have a set list. That is just the craziest words to come out of my mouth. The last time I played was the last Sunday I was at church. I played in high school for the high school youth group and that was March 8th, 2020. Almost six months to the day I'll be playing again. The first song we're doing vertical worship song, Yes I Will. The second song will be a Bethel music song, Promises Never Fail. And then we're doing Build My Life. There will be a fourth song. They have not put it in Planning Center online yet, which is the software we use to get the songs, the music, all the communication, commitment to dates and all of that. I have nerves. I have nerves. I have a lot of nerves. Are any of you gigging again? Do you have nerves too? I am nervous. Like, am I gonna remember how to set up my gear? Am I gonna remember how to load out? And how rusty am I gonna be? If you're a musician, let me know. How was your practicing during the virus? There's been a lot going on in my world. I'm from Seattle, so we've had a lot of stuff going on around police brutality and um, racial issues. And my mind and heart have been a thousand different directions. Yeah, I'm like super distracted. I am gonna focus on practicing this week. I plan on bringing my camera to rehearsal and to the gig so you guys can see a little bit of what we have going on. These are obviously super copywritten songs, so I may only be able to play you a little bit. Copyright law is a complicated thing, so I have to be careful what I publish, but we'll see what I can come up with, let you see a little behind the scenes of how we're getting back in the routine of things because it's all going to feel so new, so new. One other little bit of business for the Real Beal fam is that I have Amazon affiliate links down below and to be part of the Amazon program, people have to click on the links and no one has clicked on the links. I mean, I'm not even talking about buying anything. I'm talking about just click throughs. I haven't gotten any lately. And so I know when I was on the old program, I was on magic links, people were clicking through, but I got all new links on Amazon. So if you can take a few minutes and go down to the description and click a few of those links, anything you buy in like the next 24 hours, regardless of whether it was something I referred you to or not, I get a little bit of credit. And that means that they are not gonna eliminate me from the program, which I would like to not be eliminated. And I really linked some really cool gear. Let me tell you what's down there. Down in the links below, I have the American Performer Fender Mustang Bass. I also have a Wire by Fender Bronco Bass. The Ibanez Acoustic Electric Bass that I play. The Peltrain Classic Junior Pedal Board and Soft Case that I own the Big Muff Distortion Pedal, the Polytune Tuning Pedal, the Boss NS2 Pedal, Roland Instrument Cables, and my Mackie In-Ear Drivers. So if you just click through on a few of those, give them a look, see if you like the gear or not, give me some feedback in the comments, that would be great. Tell me, eh, I want you to put this up there, or put this in your description. I would love to, so give me some feedback. If you can just help me out a little bit so I don't get kicked out of the program, that would be awesome. I'll get back to my regular content. I've been on vacation. I owe you lots of responses to comments. I'm gonna make a video of that. And so be keeping your eyes open. Also, my interface has been shipped. 
So I will be able to record me playing bass directly into my computer again. So this is good news. That will be coming up. I also have a review of flat wounds versus round wounds that I will do as soon as I have that interface. So there's lots of good things coming up ahead for this channel. So please stay tuned. And thanks for taking a little time for a little family discussion. We just talked about, oh my gosh, I have a gig. I need to go practice. More great stuff coming and click an Amazon link down below. Thanks guys, I really appreciate you. Thanks Real Real Fam.